Hi, I'm Brad, and my whole life revolves around wild animals. I work with them 365 days of the year, no matter what the conditions are. If it's rain, snow, or sunshine, I'm out there with the wildlife. And you're off. I started working with wild animals when I was a kid, and eventually they grew into a full-time business for me. There he is, sitting right there in the stream. See him? Yep. It's just like a rock, sitting there soaking up the sun. Yeah, they're fast. Flying squirrels actually don't fly. They have a flap of skin under their legs, and they use that like a sail, like almost like a hang glider, and they glide from tree to tree. After my wife began making videos of me working, I found being in front of a camera was a great opportunity to share my knowledge and ability. She's getting ready to strike, and they start to coil up like that. They're getting all their energy stored into their coils, so they can jump up and bite anything that comes by them. Got one. Ooh, it smells. Now that's you. No. In the shower. <laughs> they definitely are cute. I mean, they've got a lot of teeth. They still can hurt. You look inside their mouth, how many teeth these animals have. And their teeth are razor sharp. I have great respect for the animals I work with. I can read the body language and quickly assess how to handle them properly. This is one. Oh, they're brand new. The best thing about working with wild animals is you never know what you're going to get. Pretty gross looking. You never know what they're going to do. It's just the equivalent to like a uh, dog cow. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> they're pretty aggressive, as cute as they look. They're completely unpredictable. <laughs> After all, they do have minds of their own. If you look really close at their eyes, whoa, they run up a tree. With all my experience in dealing with wild animals, I am ready for whatever comes at me. I've been working with wildlife for over 30 years now and I'm ready to take it to a whole new level.